Number 1. Crown Prince Faza One of the wealthiest royals in the world is Faza, the Crown Prince of Dubai, with a personal net worth of $400 million. Given the estimated $18 billion worth of the Dubai royal family, it is not surprising that the prince has extravagant taste. He has boats, exotic animals valued at millions of dollars, his own fleet of luxury tanks, the most expensive horse and camel in the world, amphibious vehicles, and interesting hobbies. This is luxurious and chic, and make sure to watch until the end to find out all the interesting facts about the extravagant lifestyles of the royal Arab billionaires. Hit like and subscribe for more videos like this. Don't believe the extravagant spending of Dubai's royal prince. Of course, the prince, also known as Sheikh Hamdan bin Muhammad, has a wide selection of luxurious residences to choose from. The Dubai family owns a large number of luxurious properties around the world, but Faza prefers these. The first is the Royal Palace. The Zabil Palace is reported to be worth $500 million and belongs to Sheikh Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum, the ruler of Dubai and Faza's father. Although the interior has been kept somewhat secret and guests are not permitted near the royal residence, these images of another of Dubai's royal palaces give us an indication of how opulent it is on the inside. The prince's favorite place to get away from Dubai is Vancouver, Canada, where he has a $55 million penthouse at the Fairmont Pacific Rim Hotel. Faza originally purchased one of the building's penthouses for $25 million in 2017, but he swiftly followed up by purchasing three sub-penthouse condos, increasing the total investment to $55 million, which he apparently paid in cash. But how? Faza's private investment company, Zabil Investments, owns a number of properties in the United Arab Emirates, notably the Jumeirah Zabil Saray Hotel. The $12 billion Dubai Hotel boasts its own indoor and outdoor pools, as well as access to private beaches and a plethora of luxury rooms. There are 405 rooms available for guests, as well as 38 royal suites where the Dubai royals, including Faza, can experience Zabil grandeur. Faza has earned the title of Animal Whisperer as a result of his extensive collection of unusual pets. What do you think he owns? Tigers, elephants, lions, and numerous remarkable peacocks are among his collection, though nothing compares to his camel, which is the most costly animal on the planet. The prince chose this camel out of 17,000 candidates while seeking for the world's greatest camel in addition to his collection. He paid $2.7 million for the camel. Yes, you heard it right, $2.7 million for a camel. And it's been the star of his Instagram account since then. The prince also has individual falcons, and he is projected to have hundreds, and they can win him more than $100,000 whenever they win a race or competition. Prince Faza also owns another animal that is rumored to be the most valuable of its kind. Do you know how much he spent on it? The prince reportedly spent $1.8 million on one of his treasured show horses, which he has been seen displaying off at contests all around the world. The prince is said to own over 1,000 horses around the world and at least 120 camels on his Dubai farm. Yes. 1,000 horses and 120 camels. Have you seen the prince's multi-million dollar automobile collection? I must say, it does have several gold-plated cars. A gold Rolls-Royce Phantom valued at estimated $8.2 million is one of them. He also has a $7.5 million golden Lamborghini Aventador, a $5.8 million gold Porsche 918 Spider, and a gold Range Rover Vogue estimated to be worth at least $3.2 million. He also owns a $4.5 million Lamborghini Veneno Roadster. Only nine cars were ever made when the car was released in 2014, 
and he had it gold-plated for an undisclosed but most likely expensive sum. His most valuable golden vehicle, though, is a Mercedes AMG G63 valued at an incredible $9.6 million. His collection consists of more luxury automobiles that are as remarkable. Wait to see! He owns a $1.9 million Aston Martin 177, which was previously the world's most expensive car. It got its name from the fact that just 77 of these cars exist. Another one-of-a-kind addition to his collection is his Bugatti Veyron Grand Sport. It has a bizarre reptilian body and can reach speeds of 250 miles per hour. It cost the prince $1.7 million. These could not be missing from his collection. A LaFerrari valued at $2.1 million and a $1.5 million Ferrari F12 Berlinetta. Did you know this? Prince Faza also has a magnificent collection of luxury tanks. Yes, tanks! Tanks that can plow through any terrain from sand to mud and are military grade and practically indestructible. The prince has been seen taking them on joyrides and Dubai's deserts. Well, in case you are considering purchasing one, the single-seat model costs $495,000, the two-seat model $545,000, and the four-seat model $595,000. And what else does he collect? Well, he also has a sizable collection of amphibious vehicles. The prince used to be a huge admirer of the python, but now his eyes were gazed upon the panther. Though the python can reach a record setting speed on water of roughly 60 miles per hour, it comes with a hefty $300 price tag. The latest pythons are even faster. To add to his collection, the prince spent $800,000 on multiple panthers. You may ask by now, what about yachts or planes? Prince Faza owns a couple magnificent mega yachts to enjoy a relaxing time at sea. The $70 million Esmeralda is one of them, but his most costly yacht, which he purchased in 2013, cost $180 million. It also includes just about everything you can possibly need on the sea, like a Zane Bolt designed gym, numerous pools, a personal spa, and a helipad. The prince, of course, has his own private plane, a Boeing 747-400 that costs over $260 million. The Dubai Royal Air Wing is the aircraft that members of the royal family can use. However, he prefers to fly first class and Emirates, which costs at least $600 per hour of flight time, and each ticket can potentially cost more than $20,000 around the world. So, where did the prince get his enormous wealth? The prince's money is kept coming in through Zabil Investments, a private investment company that has invested billions in real estate and construction projects, but his connections to the royal family have a significant impact on his ability to accumulate wealth. And even though most of his activities are purely for pleasure, he is extremely talented and competes frequently. He's a multi-award winning horse rider, a semi-professional skydiver, and a talented athlete. He's also a poet and photographer, founded the Hamdan International Photography Award. Number 2. Turki bin Abdullah Al Saud Turki bin Abdullah, a Saudi billionaire, owns a $22 million automobile collection that will leave you in awe. The ultra-wealthy royal never misses a chance to flaunt his gold-plated supercars and high-end cruisers, and he's even racked up some expensive parking charges while driving around London in his whips. The socialite prince is said to be tied to the House of Saud, which is worth approximately $1.4 trillion at the time of writing. The parking tickets didn't bother him too much. Here's a peek at some of Turki bin Abdullah's stunning gold supercars. The spectacular Bugatti Veyron, which typically sells for $1.9 million, is one of his collection's highlights. When a Veyron is wrapped in gold, expect the price to skyrocket. Bin Abdullah's gold-plated Veyron is reported to be worth $10 million, and it usually attracts attention when he drives it. The Veyron may be the most stunning vehicle ever created. It's the epitome of performance in the supercar world. The vehicle has an 8-liter quad turbocharged W16 engine that can attain a top speed of 408 kilometers per hour.
The strong engine produces over a thousand horsepower and can accelerate the Varen from 0 to 100 kilometers per hour in just 2.5 seconds. He drives around in his gold-plated Rolls-Royce Phantom Coupe when he wants to be a little more fancy. The $4 million work of art has a top speed of 250 km per hour and can accelerate from 0 to 100 km per hour in just 6 seconds. Ben Abdullah's 18-carat gold-encrusted Rolls-Royce is as beautiful on the interior as it is on the appearance. The Rolls-Royce Phantom Coupe's exquisite interior is adorned with the best leathers, woods, metals, and fabrics. It is without a doubt the best saloon automobile available. Ben Abdullah also has a G63 AMG 6x6 Mercedes-Benz worth $2.6 million. His G63 6x6 looks quite at home, ripping over the Saudi Arabian desert's sandy dunes. Ben Abdullah even shared a video of himself and his G63 6x6 racing alongside a camel. The camel had no chance at a top performance of 161 km per hour. The AMG was only marketed for two years, thus even non-gold examples are uncommon. He's the proud owner of a limited edition mid-engine plug-in hybrid Porsche 918 Spider. It has a 6.8 kilowatt hour lithium-ion battery pack that provides a 19 km all-electric range. The 918 Spider of Bin Abdullah is not only gold but also green. The $1.5 million Marvel is lightning quick. It has a top speed of 340 km per hour and can accelerate from zero to 100 km per hour in under 2 minutes and 6 seconds. The Lamborghini Aventador SV owned by Ben Abdullah isn't quite unique, but it's close. It's worth $1.2 million because it's one of only 500 made. Car's famous scissor doors as well as the gold wrap really make this supercar pop. Ben Abdullah also has a $1 million Lamborghini Huracan with a V10 engine and an electronically controlled all-wheel drive system. One of the most cheap luxury automobiles on the market is the Bentley Flying Spur. The Flying Spur's base price is $187,000, but Turkey bin Abdullah decided to take things to a whole new level, so he dressed it in gold. The W12 engine in bin Abdullah's $500,000 Bentley Flying Spur produces 616 horsepower, making it both powerful and spectacular. A regular Range Rover Vogue is as understated as they come. Turkey bin Abdullah's Range Rover Vogue, on the other hand, is not only wrapped in gold, but also features a high-end Hammond Motorsport tuning kit. The $500,000 SUV boasts 322 horsepower instead of the regular 272, as well as massaging seats and a refrigerator compartment. The Range Rover Vogue has a top speed of 210 km per hour and can accelerate from 0 to 100 km per hour in about 8 seconds. Turkey bin Abdullah's automobile collection is not all gold. In addition, he owns a $450,000 Maybach 62. When he wants to stay hidden, he probably drives about in his Maybach 62. While the Maybach 62 is a stylish vehicle, it is unlikely to attract attention, especially if it is just painted in black. However, there is a gold Maybach 62 in the wild, but it does not belong to Turkey bin Abdullah. Theo Pophitis, the Dragon's Den star and businessman, is said to own a $57 million Maybach 62. Yes, you heard that right, $57 million. Pafaita's Maybach 62 has gold not just on the outside, but the interiors as well. Although not everyone can buy a gold-plated car like Turkey bin Abdullah's, it is conceivable to ride in one even if money is tight. MyWhip, a London-based taxi service, provides users the opportunity to be escorted about in a gold-plated supercar. But it's entirely up to chance. Like, 1 out of 100 chance of being picked up by a supercar like a Lamborghini or a McLaren dressed in gold. Did you know Turkey bin Abdullah has a cheetah as a pet? He even allows the large cat to take a ride in his supercars. We're curious as to how he maintains this speedy cat calm while roaming the streets. Bin Abdullah isn't the only millionaire in the Middle East who has a large cat. The Persian Gulf's ultra-wealthy royals are huge fans of lions, tigers, and cheetahs. 
I'm sure you want to know more about these Arab billionaires and their lavish lifestyle, so tune in for part 2. And if you want to know about the most expensive things in the world, look inside the lives of the wealthiest people on the planet, or how to achieve success in your life, make sure to hit the subscribe button and stay updated on our latest videos. Don't forget to hit the like button!